I'm Nicole Dobransky and I was part of the four week um, gut protocol and four weeks for everybody test group. And after those four weeks, I felt better than I have in years since before becoming a mom seven years ago. And I'm running faster, which is such a huge perk if you are a fellow runner and you are looking for a way to boost your performance. I know for me, I'm 38 years old and I have this, I've had big running goals um, for pretty much since I started running 10 years ago. And I honestly started to think that those weren't possible anymore because I'm getting older and I'm busy and I just felt myself being tired. And honestly, after my long runs, a lot of times I would be so wiped out, even from it, like not even that long of a long run that it would impact my entire day. And I kind of thought, you know, marathons aren't in the cards for me anymore. And maybe, you know, that BQ dream that I have is not possible. But after the four weeks of doing, of switching my eating and noticing how much quicker I'm recovering from my runs and my workouts, how much better I feel day to day, I feel more fit than ever. I lost eight pounds and six inches in just four weeks and I've actually continued to lose weight since finishing the program because I've, can, I've been just changed my habits. I'm lighter and I'm faster. I actually ran a half marathon back in December and then I ran another half marathon um, right after I finished gut protocol. So just a two month difference. And I was able to take three minutes off my time on a harder course. The first one was like a net decline. This one was just flat and I felt so good. So, um, it's going to have a huge impact if you're a runner on your, on your running, because if we don't like, I didn't really even realize the, the fact that, um, our gut and our everyday nutrition has such a big impact on our athletic performance. I think we all get so focused on the before what we eat before our runs, what we eat after our runs. And we fail to acknowledge that all of that nutrition that we have is also affecting us. And I think sometimes as runners, when we're like, oh, I burned so many calories running, like I can eat whatever I want. Yes, I mean, we, I'm not saying that we shouldn't have treats and those don't have, belong in our, in our healthy diet. But what I found was by choosing healthier options overall, I feel, like I just said, I feel so good. <laughs> I feel so good. I'm sleeping better and I have more energy. And um, I also have an issue sometimes with GI distress on long runs. And I've been investigating this through the program and it's dramatically improved since doing this. So I wanna ensure you that that is not normal <laughs> and that you can find a solution to that. So um, another thing that I often get asked is like how it impacted my family when I was doing the gut protocol. So. For us, we eat. Fa I thought we ate fairly healthy, or we do eat fairly healthy. So it wasn't a dramatic shift in my, the meals that I was preparing. There were some, there were differences, but I found that my husband was on board with it, um, and he just basically ate more of what I ate. And my kids even started eating healthier too. We discovered my kids love roast sweet potatoes. Um, it also because I was preparing some of more food in advance. I was kind of living on this life of like convenience, like okay, I'll throw this together real quick. And sometimes that meant if I was busy, I just, we'd order out or we would end up making something not as healthy. But because I was preparing in advance and um, making sure that we had food on hand, because I knew if I was really hungry and I didn't have the healthy food on hand, I'd be more likely to fall off. Um, because we had that food on hand, that meant my family and I were eating healthier overall. So my daughter was eating like sweet potatoes in her lunch, which was not the case before. So just some small examples of how it was better. Also, we were keeping a lot of treats and sweets in the house and my kids, I think since Halloween to Christmas and me, were eating chocolate every single day. And I was amazed by how when we just didn't have that stuff in the house, we all didn't eat it. And I noticed that my kids had less like mood swings because they weren't eating as much sugar. So it's like those little things where even though they're not on the plan with you, like my husband was on it, I would say like 80% with me. Um, he was eating healthier overall and he was feeling better. And he even told me today, he's like, even in the bedroom, things were better. So <laughs> it's like, it has been such a game changer for me. And like I said, I feel like I've changed, like it's, it's realigned me with my, just my overall health and just feeling like I know how good it feels to feel good and I don't want to stop. So while yes, I have incorporated some of the foods that I've realized don't cause sensitivities with me back in, I'm eating healthier overall since finishing and I'm feeling good. I'm feeling motivated. I'm actually like researching marathons again, thinking maybe I can do this. And I just encourage you if you are looking for, um, just a way to treat your body well and a community like ours, our bod groups are gonna be amazing where we're gonna support you and you're gonna be in community with other women who are doing this with you. Um, you gotta do it with us. So have a great day and I'm happy to answer any questions that you have and I can't wait to see you in our group.